Hi, I'm Michael Seymour. My role is a tree inspector, which involves generally inspecting the parishes uh, around Harborough, but also being involved with the ash dieback surveys across Leicestershire County as a whole. So the majority of the signs are, are in the crown of the tree. Um, there's an increase in epicomic growths, which are little shoots here where you wouldn't normally expect them to appear. Um, often they're a sign of stress in the tree. You get lesions on the trunk, which can, which well, are necrotic and can lead to secondary pathogens such as honey fungus. In the crown itself, uh, the leaves start to die back and eventually you end up with uh, large amounts of dead wood. Often you get pom-pom growth where you've got just little bits of growth left on the ends of branches. Just a general reduction in canopy cover uh, is one of the things we look at as the percentage of um, leaf cover remaining. However, ash trees by their nature have character uh, in their form, certain amount of subjectivity when, when deciding on um, what percentage of canopy cover they have. But the main things to consider are, are where the branches die back uh, or are dying back and they will be weaker as a result um, more likely to snap out. 